and good day. My name is Jürgen Steinmetz from eTurbo News, and this is a breaking news update. For more news updates and shows, please go to youtube.com slash travel news group, youtube.com slash travel news group. Here's our update. Tourists and residents must show vax negative test proof to enter Oahu businesses. Honolulu Mayor Rick Blanjardi announced today, Monday, August 30, 2021, that starting September 13, 2021, all customers who want to enter certain Oahu establishments will need to present proof of vaccination or proof of a negative COVID-19 test within the past 48 hours. This new Safe Access Oahu emergency order is in response to the ongoing surge of new COVID-19 cases that has emerged since the arrival of Delta variants. These heightened number of cases is putting a huge demand on Hawaii's hospitals and workers. Included with proof of vaccination or negative test results, workers of these businesses will also have to show their vax cards or test results. This new emergency order will remain in effect for at least 60 days. The state and county have also instituted vaccine mandates for employees. Children under 12, who are ineligible for vaccines, are exempt from the requirements. The following businesses are following under this new mandate. Restaurants and bars, takeout is exempt. Alcohol will stop being served at 10 p.m. gyms and fitness facilities, including dance studios, bowling alleys, arcades, and billiards halls, movie theaters, museums, indoor portions of botanical gardens, aquariums, sea life attractions, zoos, commercial recreational boating, public and private commercial pools, shooting, archery ranges, other commercial attractions like go-kart, mini golf, any establishments offering food and or drink for on-premises consumption. Acceptable proof of vaccination. Proof of full vaccination means demonstrating that you have completed a vaccination regimen approved by the Hawaii Department of Health in compliance with all requirements of the state's safe travels program through providing a hard copy of a state-approved vaccination card, a photographed digital copy of a state-approved vaccination card, or a Hawaii state-approved digital, smart device application confirming full vaccination status including via the safe travels program, application. You must also present identification with the same information as the proof of vaccination. Full vaccination means two weeks have passed after the second dose in a two-dose COVID-19 vaccination series which has been authorized for emergency use or approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Alternatively, two weeks must have passed after a single-dose COVID-19 vaccination which has been authorized for emergency use or approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration, regardless of whether a COVID-19 vaccine booster has been received. If an individual refuses to show proof of vaccination or proof of a negative COVID-19 test at an establishment may not enter except for very quick and limited purposes, such as using the bathroom, picking up food, paying a bill, or changing in a locker room. When entering a venue for such limited purposes, the individuals must wear a face mask. Honolulu Mayor Rick Blanjardi said businesses covered by the Safe Access Oahu program will be expected to enforce the new rules. Those that don't could face fines or even temporary closure. Oahu restaurants and other establishments will also continue to be subject to current capacity restrictions also of note to tourists who travel to Hawaii. Thank you for listening to our news update. There's more on youtube.com slash travel news group. Or you can read us, of course, in going to our news portal at etobernews.com or travelnews.online. Thank you.